Hi, my name is Katie Shu. I am a biology and psychology double major at Stony Brook University, class of 2025. And my project focuses on the protein C1Q and its receptors GC1QR and CC1QR as potential novel targets in cervical cancer across African American and East Asian populations. My lab focuses on complement proteins C1Q, GC1QR, and CC1QR and its role in modulating cell growth. My project specifically uses Eastern Asian and African American cell lines to determine the presence of these complement proteins in cervical cancer. By doing so, our lab hopes to better understand GC1QR, CC1QR, and C1Q as potential biomarkers and therapeutic targets across diverse populations in cancer. This summer, I used amino assays such as ELISA's and Western blots to determine the presence of these complement proteins in cervical cancer cell lines CIHA and HILA. This protein detection step became the cornerstone of my project, allowing me to move on to investigating antibody treatments against these proteins. And then after that, we will use cell proliferation assays to see whether antibody treatments further inhibit the growth of cancer cells. I am motivated by firsthand experiences of the healthcare system, especially as a daughter of a cancer survivor. I am extremely grateful and fulfilled to participate in transformative cancer research that is affecting women of color. Being a Valet Fellow enhanced my college experience because it gave me a scholarship to conduct research over the summer, which alleviated a lot of the financial burden, as well as connecting me with a network of amazing women. In the future, I hope to pursue a career in medicine. I hope to also continue growing as a cancer researcher and mentoring other students to make a positive impact the same way I am now. I'm proud that this research is helping me to engage with the research field and how it interlocks with medicine. I would like to thank the Francis Villay Fellowship Program and the Panafil Foundation for making my research possible this summer. I'm also very happy to thank the College of Arts and Sciences staff and faculty for collaborating with this program and allowing us to all conduct research.